Hello, I'm Scott Huber. Today we're going to talk about gas management systems for the MIG welding process. So over the last few years, gas delivery has evolved, allowing electronic welding regulators to be introduced into the market. Traditionally, you have a flow meter with a sight tube, a pressure regulator, or a brass fitting that has a drilled hole for a set flow rate. So with those type of gas delivery systems, they're mechanical and they rely on incoming pressure to be constant. Some of the shortcomings that a mechanical process has is the distance from where you mount the, the flow device versus where the torch is. The longer this distance is, the more fluctuation you're going to have in the gas delivery process. Uh, one of the problems you have is as your plant runs out through the day, your pressure coming out of your bulk system or your tanks may fluctuate. So on a fluctuation on incoming pressure, your outgoing pressure is going to fluctuate, then affecting your flow rates. Electronically, as we're monitoring that flow rate and the back pressure in that line, we're able to adjust and make sure that flow rate is consistent all the way through the process, all the way out to the nozzle. Now with the introduction with Industry 4.0, you can seamlessly integrate your gas management system with your control processes. One of the advantages of having an electronic gas management system is the ability to be able to collect data at any given point in time of the process. So if you wanted to measure gas delivery over a part, over an hour, over a day, it all depends on how much data you want to store and collect. Uh, you can turn this system on, record, walk away from it for a week if you'd want to, come back, analyze that data and see how efficient your process is. You have a closed loop system. It's constantly back checking itself to make sure that the flow rate that you're asking for is the flow rate it's achieving. This in turn allows for us to monitor incoming pressure, outgoing pressure, and flow rates along with adapting to the current of our welding process. When our incoming pressure starts fluctuating, it's adjusting to the outgoing, make sure the outgoing flow is maintained. Traditionally, what we do is we set our flow rates up for the worst condition in our weld process. You know, if you have porosity in your welds, um, you know, you're usually using more gas than you need typically, and with that, wasting a lot of gas. If you'd like to learn more about electronic gas management systems, please contact your local Benzel rep. I'm Scott Huber. Thanks for watching.